Hello everyone, welcome back to this Microsoft Excel tutorial journey with me on my Knowledge Factor YouTube channel. This is the 64th session in this journey and here the first tool that I want to get into within working with a list inside of Excel in this section and this is perhaps one of the most common tools that are used inside of a list. Now think about this, what's the purpose of a list? Think about that, well, well it's to store a data, I have got a list of employee records I got to put those someplace where I store the data there. Well, why are you storing the data? Well, I am storing the data so that later on I can find it. Yeah. The ultimately the purpose of a list is so that you can work with the data, right? You can find the data. Well, one of the most effective ways of finding data is organizing it properly, sorting the list. I want to sort this list to make it easier to find a specific records. So let's think about this for a moment. What might be something you would sort this list by so that you can more easily make this list more accessible so that you can find the data. Think about that for a moment. So look at those column header. What would you sort this list on make it easier to find? Well, you, you might think, well, it depends on what you are looking for. Well, if I am just looking for a specific employee, maybe I'll sort this list by the last name, right? I'll sort it by the last name so I get it in ascending order A to Z and I can skim through the list to find those specific employees with specific last names. Oh, well, you know what? I want to find employees that um, work in a specific location. Right? Well, hey, no problem. We'll sort the list by location, building 1s, building 2s, building 3s. We'll put it in the proper order to make it easier to find things. Now, hey, uh, think about this. Anybody use a phone book anymore? Do you still get one of those on your doorstep? I, I get one a few months back and I thought, what am I going to do with that? Right? Right to the recycle bin. <laughs> hey, I, I don't use them anymore, but think about this. What if a phone book was not sorted? Would you find anything? You might find something, it, it would take you forever to find it because it's not organized properly in an accessible way. So we sort the list to make it easier to find. So here's the first method on sorting a list, really simple, was this. I want to sort my list by last name. So I click into the last name column, doesn't matter where, just anywhere in the column and I'm going to perform what I call a quick sort. I want to sort by last name, identify that by clicking into it and uh, I'm going to go to my data tab. On my data tab I got a place called sort and filter and then there I got three sort buttons but the first two are my quick sorts. I can sort ascending, I can sort descending, I'm going to do ascending A to Z. I'll give that a click and now I have sorted my list by a last name in ascending order. You can see it's A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H and so on. Really simple, click into the column you want to sort on and I wanted to do my last name, go up the data, make your selection an ascending or descending order, whatever is going to make it easier for you to find the data. So try this out, identify how you want to sort this list, what's going to make it easier to find specific records. Well I did my last name, you might do it by department. You might do it by location, you might do it by hire date, whatever it is. Head up to the data tab, select your order. You have now sorted your list and made it more accessible. Thanks for watching this tutorial and as I always say if you really liked it and enjoying this journey then please do like, share and subscribe my channel and also press the bell icon to get the latest content update on this channel. Alright then we'll meet up in the next session in case you have any questions, any concerns then do let me know in the comment section of this video. Till the time goodbye and take care.